purchased this new game camera the covert MPE5 6 megapixel pictures Got the camera. Wow, it's really light. We have a strap to put it on the tree or wherever we're going to mount it. We have the USB cable so that we can take the pictures from the camera. DLC covert warranty registration and a user's manual. Take a look at this. Open it up. Okay, it looks like our batteries will go in here and our settings is over here. We got on, we got set up, and we got off. Something else we need to do here. We have this lens over top of that just go ahead and peel that off what I've done I've went down and I purchased eight rechargeable batteries from Radio Shack open this up and you can pretty much tell right here it says positive negative positive negative here's a power source where you can put power in which it did not come with a power adapter. You got your USB port and you have a SD card slot and you have to have an SD card in this unit before it will power on. We'll go ahead and shut it. Okay, now if we turn it over to the bottom as you can see there's a place where you can actually pull this up and you can actually run a battery into here external battery. I also purchased this steel box for the covert game camera. It uh, is a camouflage in the front or they got paint on it. On the bottom it has openings for your external power and uh, for the uh, mount if you choose to put something in there. On the back got your holes so that you can mount it to the tree or to a to a uh, pole or however you decide to mount it open it up you can see the lock will go here once you get it together we'll take the camera go ahead and turn your camera on when you uh, put it in before you put it in here drop it in there fits like a glove drop your cover on there slide your cover okay now put your lock on there and they'll have to destroy this box and your camera if they want that camera as you can see on the bottom you can see your auxiliary and your mounting port for your camera also I had this here, these didn't come with the uh, mount. I had to go purchase some lag bolts so that I could mount this to the tree. I'm gonna go ahead and mount my casing to the tree that the camera goes in. I'm gonna mount it right here underneath this camera here because I wanna get video on one and I wanna get still pictures on the other. There. Made sure that all my settings were correct. I'm going to turn it on and I'm going to put it in the box. And then I'm going to put the cover over top of it and put a lock on it. So this is ready to go. And now we'll go ahead and wait and see what kind of pictures we get. We will wait a couple days and we will 
slide it over to still frame because right now I got it on videos. I might be expecting too much from these videos. I mean, you can see really clearly what the animals are. They're black and white because it's nighttime. Now, on the daytime videos, really good videos. I like the clarity of the videos, and you can really see what's going on. Especially on the 6 megapixel pictures, the pictures turned out real well, as did the videos in the daytime. But you can still tell at nighttime what the animal actually is. Not a bad picture, but then, you know, it's, it's at night. These are the still pictures, 6 megapixel, black and white, and the color pictures. I was really impressed with the quality of these pictures. Check out the hawk on top of the post on the last two pictures. You also have all the information at the bottom of the picture.